PsychBooks is a database of full-text books on topics in psychology. It's great for psychology students looking for in-depth information on the topic. PsychBooks is one of the EBSCO databases, which means the interface and the way you search in it, it's going to be basically the same as any other EBSCO database. On the opening page of the database you can set up your search, enter your search terms in the box. At the end of this tutorial, there's a link to a tutorial on how to construct a good search. The number of books that your search found is listed in the center next to search results. You can use the buttons on the left to narrow down that number. Select the options that apply to your search, such as the range of publication dates, or the type of publication, and wait for the update. If you don't like your results after using any limit, just click on the little X next to that limit, and the database will remove it from the search. To learn more about a book, click on its title. This brings us to the full record, which provides a lot of information. At the top, you will find the citation information, including the author and title of the book. The source line contains the title, volume number, and page numbers of the chapter of the book shown. All of this information will be important when you complete your bibliography. There are a couple of ways to get a sense of what a particular book is about before you read the actual text. The subject terms are tags that describe the actual subject of the book. The abstract is a short summary of the book. Skimming the abstract is the best method of finding whether a book is relevant to you. There are two places you can look to find the full text of a book. If you are in the full record, look on the upper left side of the page. If you are in the list of books, look at the bottom of each record. Click on the PDF full text link to read a scanned copy of the original book. There are a couple of useful buttons on the right side of the full record screen. You can email a book to yourself, and the full text will come as an attachment with the email. You can automatically get the citation for a book, though you should double check it for correctness and you can click the folder icon to save the book online. For details on how to use the folder, searching strategies, and more, click on these links.